Alright, what's up next? We do still have more quests to do, so... Welcome back, and fine work with your surveying. Pardon the imposition, but would you follow me to the training grounds? Sure. I will totally do that. I called you here for one very specific reason. I wish to have you try your hand at a new form of Pokemon battle. I used to think that Pokemon were terrifying creatures. You've helped me see otherwise. Thanks to you, there are some in this village who now enjoy battling with Pokemon. More and more of us now see Pokemon as allies. It is for that reason that I would like you to continue to further your trailblazing. I believe that taking part in a new form of battle will help deepen our understanding of Pokemon. In the midst of a tough battle, what does your partner desire? And what is your opponent thinking? I believe that you have the ability to sense these things, and we'll do our best to learn as well. This is quite a difficult request we have for you, but I'm sure you are up for the challenge. You must Ingo here for a more detailed explanation. I leave the rest to you. Please let me know when you're ready to try your hand at these new battles. Okay, sent to storage. Uh, I know this person, Zizu, has had a request for a long time, so let's go ahead and check it out. Hello there. You know, we have an interesting member of the security corps, a secret weapon, if you will. They're a bit of a Pokemon battle master, in fact. Think I could trouble you to face our secret weapon in battle? Of course. Battling the Security Corp secret weapon. Give us a moment then. So, I heard the news. There's to be a face off between two masters. You know, I've heard the Corp secret weapon can even defeat Alpha Pokemon. Oh, really? Oh, really? <laughs> Everything's set. Come with me. Oh, really? This secret weapon could defeat Alpha Pokemon. Wow. <laughs> oh, it's the guard that I always talk to? Here's our ace in the hole, Ress. Please, Captain Zizu, I'm just a common guardsman. However, so long as I stand in defense of this gate, I have no intention of letting anyone defeat me. Ooh. I always look for strong battlers. Let's do it. Bidoof. Okay. Go partner. Partner Typhlosion. Level 62 Bidoof. Uh, let's go with... Flamethrower. I'm assuming he knows a dark type move, so that's going to be bad. If I don't defeat you. Yeah. Hyper Potion, okay. And then Shadow Ball, that's it. That's what will do it. Okay. So against Bidoof. Uh, it's a normal type. Oh, you know what I need to bring with me? I definitely need Arceus. That's who I need. I don't have Arceus with me. Because I kind of forgot that that was a Pokemon. <laughs> I honestly forgot that I did not even have an Arceus with me. But I've never used it in battle before, so I should definitely check that out. Alright, let's try Roar of Time. Could I go first? No? Alright, let's try that one. Roar of Time. Oh my god. If I used a normal one, it would have worked. You know, Ice Beam. Okay, let's try a flash cannon. It's only one Pokemon down. One Pokemon down. Sent out Shinx. Play rough. Okay. Um, let's try ourselves a... Another Roar of Time. Okay, not bad. Not bad, not bad. And let's try ourselves a... 
Oh, shoot. I didn't even notice Earth Power. <laughs> okay. I completely forgot Dialga had Earth Power. And I completely just scanned it with my eyes and did not even realize that it was actually super effective. <laughs> completely forgot about that. Alright. You are dealing some damage. Let's try a strong roar of time. Boom. That's what I needed to do all the time, but <laughs> I didn't know. Alright. You broke through my defenses. I thought I could do better than that, seeing as how I'm a guardsman. Maybe I should be a guardsman. Uh huh. Have you ever thought of that? <laughs> Guards woman. That was to be expected. Setting out beyond the village and battling so many different Pokemon in the course of your survey corps work has made you very strong. You know, my first job as a guardsman was catching some Bidoof that seemed intent on infiltrating the village. Since then, I've kept many Pokemon from passing through the, our gates. Sometimes I'd slip up and let some in. Goodness, would people let me have it. But I also befriended some of the Pokemon, and before I knew it, we'd grown strong together. I gained so much and all... Because I was trying to make sure folks could live safely here. It's my job to keep everybody safe, isn't it? Now, there's one last thing I'd like to tell you. If you're heading outside the village again, stay safe out there. And now that I think about it, I get. Be I better get back to work. Okay. Of course I'm going to stay safe. Isn't that, you know, the obvious statement? Alright. Uh, let's see. I could go ahead and put my Ogwav berries away for now. And I never use these, so let's put those in there as well. Okay. And let's go ahead and get Arceus on my team. Just in case I have to battle anyone else. I've never battled with Arceus before, so I want to see what it's about. I mean, I've seen it before. I've seen someone battle with Arceus before, but I haven't battled Arceus. Alright, let's see. Get out for Swinub. That Swinub was used for a request, but I never switched it out again. Okay, so. Let's see. So, I did. Let's go and check my request real quick. That was a lot of requests. Um... Let's go ahead and check what we got. So we started on 95. So it's 95, 96, 7, 8, 9, 100, 1, 2. Those were all of Mai's request. Now we have digging for tomorrow. Oh yeah, this is the one that I got before I started the DLC. So calm the raging Pokemon in Urberg Tunnel. Calm the raging Pokemon. I think I should go do that first, before I talk to Ingo. Seems like I should do that. Oh, and look at this. There's an outbreak. There's an outbreak. Ain't that crazy. Ain't that crazy. There's an outbreak. Alright. Give him one moment, you guys. Um... Okay, so the thing the network um cut out again. I don't know if it's back. I hate when it does this. So I just needed like pause real quick. Just to make sure that the stream doesn't cut out. Uh, the Dark Taco. Thank you so much for that, um, chat. You are very sweet. Um, should I go check out this outbreak? <laughs> I kind of want to, but honestly, I really just need to do these requests. 
Let's do it. So right now I'm listening to the stream to make sure that it doesn't cut off because it might. Let's see. So I need to go to Erberg Tunnel. Digging for tomorrow. Let's go do that. Keep in mind, you guys, that if if the stream does like cut on its own, I will be coming back, um, like the next minute. Cause usually what happens is I have to just close the stream and reopen it. So if that happens, just keep that in mind. I'll most likely be coming back in like the next two minutes. All right, let's go check out Orberg Tunnel and calm the raging Pokemon. I'm really good at doing that, so let's go do that. I'm really good at calming Pokemon. Orberg Tunnel. I haven't been there in a long time, and I don't like tunnels, so we'll see. We'll see what happens. Alright, so here is the pin. So I guess the tunnel is probably down. Right? Yeah, it's probably down here. Yeah, that's gotta be it. Okay. Orberg Tunnel. Let's go. Let's go. So there's supposed to be a raging Pokemon here somewhere? Somewhere. Supposed to be a raging Pokemon somewhere. Oh, is that it? Yep, that's gotta be it. Let's go ahead and get Manaphy out. Oh good, you made it. Those glowing red eyes, it's one of those alpha things, right? If it's just about so much, I'm afraid it might bring the whole tunnel down. It's really dangerous. Okay, calm it. Okay, let me calm you. Just calm down, Onyx. Calm down. Grok! That's totally what an Onyx sounds like. Yep. Totally. Totally what it sounds like. Alright, it's level 60. I'm level 58. That didn't do much. Okay. Let's try a water pulse. Let's do agile. Because I'll get two attacks. Boom. I did not need two attacks. Cool. I did it just in case, though. Wow, you're as good as they say. That alpha onyx has calmed right down. Yep, all it takes is spraying it with water. Huh, I have to expect it to get right back up to dashing about. Me too. Right? Maybe, just maybe, you weren't raging at all, but actually just trying to dig a tunnel? If that's the case, we may as well dig together. That's settled then. From now on, we're a team. I guess you could say that Onyx and I are on it. <laughs> no, we can't. Now I've got a partner that's more than dependable, and it's all thanks to you. It's not much, but please take this grit rock as a token of my appreciation. Only one? I mean, you gave me iron, which is cool, but only one grit rock? There are some folks who are saying they'd make statues of Pokemon if we find some quality stone. And Leon of the Pearl Clan said we might even find coal here. Okay, partner, let's see which one of us can dig more. Okay, are you just going to stay here? I could talk to you? Okay. Where's Kochika? There you are. Okay, so I guess 
you're just gonna stay there. Okay, cool. Is there gonna actually be a tunnel? Like, dang it! I didn't want to do that. Is there actually gonna be a tunnel, um, in the future? Like, if I were to, um, if I were to come back, like, in a month from now, there's actually going to be a tunnel. Is there going to be a tunnel? I'm curious. I don't think there is. That onyx is just going to stay there, though. But okay. Uh, let's go back. Record my findings. Onyx, yep. Defeated with the water type moves, cool. Okay, 10 points. Let's go back to the village. And I think that should be it for all the side quests besides the main main quests. Let's see, so we did six. Uh, we did 95 to 102. We did 103. We did 104, yeah, and 105. Okay, so that was it. Let's see, 106 and 107. Okay, defeat Adaman. Defeat Adaman, okay. So what I have to do is go to Kobat Kosans. Oh my god, there's two outbreaks. What? That's crazy. I'm just like, what? That is really crazy. There's two outbreaks. That is interesting. Alright. Uh, I think it's right here. This one. So let's just ride there. Let's see. What's up, Adaman? You know, time changes a lot of things, but the sea stays the same. The Celestica people must have looked out at this exact same view long ago. I've got a favor to ask. Something the matter? It's about something my grandfather told me. He said the adamant crystal has the power to change mighty Dialga into its otherworldly form. Okay, I know about that. Whoa! <laughs> yep. I want to see if all the strength my partners and I have got is enough to take down mighty Dialga in that otherworldly form. Adamant's hope. Defeat Adam in a battle with only the origin form Dialga in your party. Oh my god, that's an alpha feel. I'm just like, oh my god, that's an alpha. Alpha feel. Alright, let's put only Dialga into my party. Okay, uh, let's see. He Chan, you go in here. Manaphy, you also go in here. Arceus, I can't battle with you yet, apparently. But maybe sometime soon. Palkia, you go in here. Typhlosion, I never take you out of my party, but this time I'll have to. And then you guys could just go in a random box. I guess all these boxes are full. Okay, uh, sure, just go in there. Let us multi-select. Nope, I did not want to do that. It's fine. There you go. Okay, so Mighty Dialga is here with me. Let's go. I'm ready for this. And then I'm going to have to fight Irida with only Palkia. These are little tiny challenges I have to do. Mighty Dialga give us all the gift of time, and I want to, s I want to see its real power in battle. Let's do it. Mighty Dialga, let me stand before you as leader of the Diamond Clan to find out in battle what I'm really made of. Yeah. 
Ooh, Leafeon. Is that the only one, though? Nope, you have Leafeon and Umbreon. And Vaporeon. Okay. Uh, against Leafeon, let's try Roar of Time. So I can't go first at all, so I might as well try this. Strong style, just to see if I defeat it in one hit. I didn't, by the way. <laughs> I didn't. I couldn't do it. Alright, Dark Pulse. Could I use items? I don't know. I mean, they're not doing that much damage to me. So, I mean, I guess it's fine. Offensive stats were lowered. Leaf Blade. Not very effective. Okay, let's try this again. Dialga. Roar of Time. Get wrecked. Dang it. He did not get wrecked. Okay, quick attack, not very effective. Quick attack again, not very effective. Critical hit. Strong style. Quick attack. Okay, that wasn't that strong, but sure. Another quick attack. They are really wailing on me. Before I was looking around. And then a leaf blade. Okay. Umbreon is looking around. Okay. Uh, let's try ourselves a flash cannon. Yeah. Let's try agile. I'll defeat Leafeon and then... I'll get to go again after Vaporeon attacks me with Aqua Tail. But I avoid it. Alright, uh, let's see. You're at level 34. So... Let's try a Iron Tail. That's a risk. That is a serious risk. Uh, okay, let's try War of Time. Boom. Get wrecked. Dang it. You did not. Quick attack. Aqua Tail. Okay. Let's get rid of this Umbreon. Come on. Get rid of the Umbreon. I could use items too. Okay, so let's keep this going. <laughs> keep this going. I am not gonna lose. I am not gonna lose. I refuse to lose. Okay. Uh, let's try a. Let's try a strong. No. Yeah, let's try a strong earth power. Okay. And now it's just me against Vaporeon. Also level 34. Okay. Uh, let's see. We got this one. Let's try agile because I get to go twice in a row. Always good. Boom, and then... After that, I could use Strong Earth Power. Got it. Get it, got it good. Battle decided. A lot of experience. Not enough, but it's a lot. The sheer power of Mighty Dialga. It's too much to comprehend. I'm still shaking even now. But through our battle, I think I understood the will of Mighty Dialga. Isn't that amazing? When you battle all out with someone, you really understand them. Imagine if everyone in Sui partnered up with Pokemon to express themselves through battle. Living here would be even more fun. I think I'll have my clan's folk start training up at Jubilife's training grounds. Hope we can come and see you there. Okay. I got a leaf stone from that. Cool. Okay. Uh, let's go back over here. And then we have to go to Crimson Myrlands. Alright. Let's go to the Crimson Myrlands. 
Research is coming along. Updated Leafeons and Dialga. Dialga is almost done, which is great. Almost done. Let's go back to the village. And I need to go to the Crimson Mirelands to defeat Irida, who wants to learn more about Mighty Palkia. So, let's go do that. I need only a Palkia in my party. Oh, hey, and there's massive mass outbreaks over here. So, I feel like I should check them out. Just, just cuz. Just cuz. Should I? There's massive mass outbreaks. Oh my god. It's so tempting. Alright, you know what? Let's go. Yep. Five agua. Oh. They're in my party, huh? I mean, they're in my storage. Move all at once. Let's drop some stuff. Okay. And then... Let's go. Let's at least do three. Whenever these appear, I feel like I could only like do the maximum of three. Alright. Ooh, unknown. Are you serious here? Unknown? Spir Spiritum. Spiritum? What the heck? There's a Spiritum. Is that even... That's a thing? You could get a Spiritum outbreak? Since when? I mean, I guess maybe since now. But, like, since when? It's not a thing. That is not a thing. Alright. Well, I'm checking out this ghastly one because it has the symbol of the sparkle. It has the sparkle symbol. So I'm going to check out this ghastly. And then I will go check out that spiritum outbreak. That's crazy. Spiritum outbreak. Wow. I really should have put more Pokemon on party, but... But, uh... But I didn't. <laughs> I'm just like, but I didn't. Alright, let's see. Let's go. I still have yet to find a shiny in one of these outbreaks. Hope to find a shiny. Okay, let's see. Let's try this. Against you. Get it. Let's try this against you. Seriously, look at that. Look at that. That did not work. Apparently. Okay. I want them to come closer. Just come closer to me. The rainstorm doesn't show signs of stopping anytime soon. Alright, let's attract all of them, and then let's get it. Okay, that one sees me. It's cool. I really only just wanted to catch like some of them, just to check out what outbreaks we have over here. Um, and yeah, I want to go check out that Spiritomb outbreak. And the request for Irida is down there, so I'll go do that in a bit. I've never seen a spirit tomb outbreak before. That's crazy. That's crazy rare. You could get more than one spirit tomb in the game, and I did not even know. I had no idea. Alright, this one is over here. Are they on top of the hill or below it? Yep, there they are. Wow, that is crazy. More than one Spiritomb in the game. How crazy is that? Oh, I missed that. It's fine. It's fine. Let's see if I could get a bit closer. 
and get in any grass. I don't see any grass. It's fine. Let's try to come up with them from here. Oh, that one sees me. It's cool. We're cool. Everything's cool. No, it's not cool. Never mind. I don't even know what I have to do for Spiritoon's Pokedex. But I don't think I have to catch any. You know what? I should... I shouldn't be catching these, honestly. I was just so excited. Um, times you seem to use Hex, Dark Pulse, and Strong Style. Okay. Okay. Well. Oh my god, look how they walk. That is so crazy. Shows no signs of stopping anytime soon. Okay. Oh, since I didn't have any Pokemon but Dialga in my party. Now my party is full of Gastly's. <laughs> Isn't that crazy? Now my party is actually full of Gastly. Alright, I wanted to use the Agile moves so I could see them use their attacks and then that will fill up the Pokedex. I'm thinking. I'm thinking. So let's just use another Agile, and they'll get them to use their attacks to fill up their Pokedex entry. And I'll just also go through these two, and then I'll move on to the next outbreak. Just these two for now. Extra Sensory. I think that was probably one of them, right? Or, I mean, it was Hex and probably Nasty Plot that they need to use. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. Shadow Ball. Okay, that was pretty good. Let's try a Agile Flash Cannon. So yeah, it, the Pokedex makes it so that... um. You don't need to catch multiple because you could only find the one, right? So finding a massive outbreak of Spiritomb is incredibly rare. But um, when it happens, then I guess that's where you, you know, do all the attacks or whatever. Like, get them to use their attacks. I guess. Alright, let's see. Uh, let's go show you the cynical one. I didn't finish the last one I went into, so I really want to finish this one. This one should be better. Oh, and there's a lot of grass I could hide in. Nice. Alright, let's do this. So, uh, what is that? Is that an alpha? No, that's not an alpha. For some reason, that Cyndaquil looked like an alpha. I don't know why. <laughs> I'm just like, I don't know why. It, it literally is not even... If, I don't know. For some reason, to me, it looked like an alpha. But I was just looking at its back. And the redness on its back made it look like an alpha. For some reason. Alright. This is fun. This is fun. Okay, there's one that's way over there that I need to check out. Need to go see. Alright, this one is getting suspicious. I think it's running from me. Alright, I'm in the grass. Or wheat, or whatever this is. I think it's wheat. Stop running. There you go. That should be the last one. The reported Pokemon are gone. Okay. Um, well, I think I, that gives me enough time to check out this one as well. Pretty cool. 
Um, let's go check out that Rhyhorn outbreak. It's gonna be over here. It has a little sparkle, so it should be a special outbreak. See, I still don't know what makes them special. Like, what exactly makes them special? Let me know if you guys know. Um, but yeah, I don't know what makes them special. Because honestly, they all seem special to me. <laughs> like, if they just appear with a an alpha in it or something. It doesn't seem any different than any others. I don't know. Let's see. Okay, let's go over here. There's a lot of grass for me to hide in. That's great. Okay, I have one more Pokeball. Ooh, on Rhydon for sure. That appeared right in front of my face. Okay. They're getting angry. It's fine. Uh, I could go ahead and just leave now. Let's go. No shinies. <laughs> I'm still hoping I, I'll find a shiny one of these days. In an outbreak. That would be great. You know, one of these special outbreaks. Um, okay. So I need to go over here to Irida. But first I need to go over here and make sure I only have Palkia in my party. So I could fight Irida. Alright, so let's get all these ghastlies. Nope. Here we go. And then let's go ahead and get Legendary. We need Palkia. Okay. Let's go. I could go ahead and teleport to Diamond Settlement. Here it is right there. Let's do this. Hello again. I felt your presence nearby while I was playing my flute earlier. I came to play for the di for the Diamond Clan so they can hear the melodies my clan holds dear. Oh, but seeing you reminds me. I've learned more about the Lustrous Globe. It seems to hold the power to transform Mighty Palkia into its otherworldly form, if you can believe that. Listen, I, I want to battle Mighty Palkia. I want to prove to myself that when the Pearl Clan worshipped Mighty Palkia, thinking it was Almighty Sinnoh, our belief, at least, was real. Please help me do this. Use the Lustrous Globe to transform Mighty Palkia and bring it alone to battle me. Here it is wish. I want to know what Mighty Palkia's power first hand uh, the power that brought space itself into being you got it to step forward into the great wide world takes bravery uh, bravery and determination okay let's do this so I was against Vaporeon, Leafeon and Embryon last time this time it's Flareon, Glaceon and Espeon Okay, let's see. Against Glaceon, let's do a super effective, or I mean not super effective, a strong style, Spatial Rend. Boom! Oh my god, seriously? It still didn't do it. Okay. Strong style, quick attack. Espeon is looking around. Flareon is looking around. Espeon is looking around. And Glaceon use Ice Beam. That is what I'm going to have to look out for, the Ice Beam. Uh, let's try a Agile Earth Style to get any faster at all. I'll try. There you go. 
I defeated the main Pokemon, so therefore the other two are way weaker. Alright, quick attack. And then, um, another quick attack. Alright. Um, you guys, actually, I'm gonna have to pause it right here. Give me one moment, you guys. I don't know how long it's gonna take, but I'll be back. <laughs> actually, I am back. <laughs> Didn't take too long. Um, but I mainly just came back for this battle. I just wanted to finish it real quick. Let's see. Let's quickly finish this battle. And then I have to go do something, so. Oh my god, okay. Quick attack. Okay. Ooh, I'm scared that this will miss. Let's try it. I don't know why I use Agile. I probably shouldn't have done that. Because it might not work. Yep, it works. There you go. Critical hit. You defeated Flareon. Battle decided. The sheer power, power of mighty Palkia. It's as unfathomably vast as space itself. I'm in awe before it. That was incredible. Must have been the Pearl Clan's almighty Sinnoh. Looks like the Pearl Clan's leader can really hold her own in battle, too. Did you hear that? The people of the Diamond Clan praise our Almighty Sinnoh. They praise Mighty Palkia. I want to take the spirit of respecting and cherishing one another and spread it throughout Vast Sui, and I'll do it through battling. I've decided, on behalf of the entire Pearl Clan, we will bring our battles to Jubilee Village's training grounds to let these ideas flourish. Nice! We did Irida's wish! Alright guys, well, I think that should be it of all the requests, um, minus the handful that we have for doing Ingo. So, that's actually what I'm going to have to call this episode of the Daybreak Update. Um, yeah, <laughs> it was probably a long one. Uh, but come back next time, I believe I'll be taking on all of Ingo's requests and hopefully finishing the daybreak update so i'll see you guys then